Blossoms. Oh, is waiting for the reset. There we go. Little punch blossoms. Hi, Mama. So, back to the Remy Poo. Okay. Hi. Should we put the bottle in? I know we've got to do yucky meds. Yucky meds. I wonder if I... Try mixing the food, if you will. Eat it. That's what your friend Sarah does. She makes it to measure nice with all the food. Sure. Unless I made it straight to the juice. Oh, I heard that this one may look sweet and innocent right here. It might look sweet and innocent, but he's scampy. He's a little scamp in training. Aren't you? Don't wiggle your ears at me. <laughs> All right, Mama, what are we going to do about this med situation? I do feel it is likely that it's Let's just try this. Let's just try. Where's your spoon? <laughs> We'll try a tiny bit next to some food and see if we can get it in there. Yes, it's time for Mama's delicious meds to make her foam. And she has such a big dose too.
<laughs> she's like, are you, she's like, I understand what it is that you're trying to do here. Here, if I put some unpainted food on top, how about that? What do you think? What do you think? She knows something's not quite right. So far, there's not any significant foaming. This is only about half a Because you still have another half of that milliliter to go. Are you trying to? There's extra fortifiora. Mm, fortifiora. How about if I put like I'll put them in this one in there too? Here. Now I'll try this one. I can syringe feed you this part and it would be better.
good girl. Here, keep going. It's so tasty. It's definitely not the efficient way to get the meds in. Here you go. <laughs> All right, little mama. We're just going to have to do it the hard way, I think. First, here, you work on this. You work on this. I'm going to go get the laundry out of the dryer. Here you go. This is for you. Give that a whirl. Mm, it's so tasty, look. It's tasty. Try one more. Here. How about this? Here, try this. Here. Oh, I know you're very cute. Here, go eat that. Hold your laundry. All right. I'm going to have to do it the hard way. Mm -hmm. Here. You want to try one more time? Can I try this? Do it back way. Here. Try it. See if it's 
go ahead and try. All right. It was a failed experiment. She is eating it now a little bit. Look at that. I just don't know if I mix the other half with food, is she going to still be hungry enough to eat? The amount of food I have to mix with it to trick her into eating it. Much better though than the foam, the foaminess. But, well, maybe I'll try. Maybe I'll try the other half. Okay. All right. Good job, little mama. This is would be much better. Granted, it takes a little bit longer. Or a lot longer. Yeah, I don't want that. I want to mix this with it. No, not that. No cheating. Wait, no cheating. No cheating. There. Okay. Here you go. Here you go. There's something funny about it. Yeah, keep going. She keeps circling it and trying it from a different angle. Here, how about if we put some and she likes it with Go try, try now, try now. It's so tasty. Here, no, not that one. I know you want that one. Here, try this. Look here.
takes care of Bordiflora and almost all of the Tylosin. Here you go. So the Tylosin is the uh, antibiotic for her um, Clostridium, which is one of the diarrhea causing agents. Um, but it's the taste is really bitter and so it makes her foam at the mouth and drool quite a bit. So I'm just trying to find a way to make it a little bit less since she has to have it twice a day. A way to make it a little less wretched. Here, here you go. So she's eaten most of the food, but not all of it. So I've tried doing, and she also gets a milliliter, which is kind of a lot. So I've tried doing that, and then a water chaser did not help, and then a food in a syringe chaser did not really help. Who are you talking to? So let's see. I imagine she will eventually eat this. Oh, who are you talking to? Are you encouraging Henry to come find you? So, anywho. Yeah, so it's a it's a compounded liquid. So, anywho, I will continue with the other meds and we'll see where we are. I suspect she, there's only a little bit left, so hopefully she will eat it. She likes the Fortiflora, which is the, uh, the new probiotic, and it's kind of a thing you sprinkle on top. So she actually quite likes that. So I think she may eat it. And she didn't foam at all, which is good. It took like a half hour, so that's, you know, not super convenient, but... I don't know, the foam clinging is not ideal either. Okay, so morning. And as of yesterday, she had gained back almost a pound, which is good. She's going in. So Fortiflora, Clavama. Did you just push them? Tylosin. All right, so we'll say the Tylosin is done, Fortiflora is done. Oh, don't get too comfy in there, mummy. I've got more, more to do. And then Marvel's bottle's been heating for like 20 minutes now. Okay. Um, okay, let's do your nausea meds real quick. I have oh, hi. Honey, look what I have for you. Oh, delicious. Mm. Delicious. Love it. Do you want some more hot water on it? She likes also. It's got that. Here, try that. Try that. Here, look. 
Ah. Yes, you can just lay there and then do it, right? Should we try? Let's try it over here. I'm not going it over here before. She's looking at me like, what is this thing you're going to do? What? I know I poked you. I poked you a little bit. I try to poke her in different places because she's gotten so many needles. But I'm guessing there are some places that she prefers over others. Okay, um, one more. Just a cloud box. Where's your cloud box syringe? That was her anti-nausea injection. This is her clavamox. And then she'll be done. I can feed the baby. All right, little mama. Mm. Such a good little mama. She's so good. Ready? I know. Cool. Good girl. I know. You'll be like special. Well, actually, most cats don't mind crab mucks. You're special. You're special. I know. I'm sorry. Here, have some. Have some. Delicious Thailand food to wash it down. Mmm, so tasty. Here, this stuff's good. All right, here, all the drugs are done. How about this? I know you like this. How about like this? Mmm, that's pretty tasty. Try that. So Clavamox is oral liquid. The nausea stuff is injected subcutaneously. Fortiflora is a probiotic. It's sprinkled on the food. She loves that one. And the Tylosin is a compounded oral liquid. That's the gross one. But she's now eating the rest of her medicated food.
All right. Good. Good. All right. That's good. All the meds down the hatch. So let's do some. Let's give Marvel his oh his bottle. He's been waiting very patiently. Oh, there he is. Hi, little Marvelous. And we can weigh everybody. Okay. So we can get our day started. Hi, little mama. Oh, I'm very proud of you. This is very difficult for you, but I know you're feeling better. Maybe we should do some fluids for you today. Oh, look. Marvy's ready for his bottle. Ready for his bottle. Oh, here he comes. <clears throat> okay. Oh, look at Henry. Where's my camera? He's so cute. Hi. Sorry, you guys are in the way. Oh my gosh. Come on, that's ridiculous. It's a boy and his moose. Henry. <laughs> look, he got scared. Henry, look at him. Look at him. That was adorable. Sorry about this. Sorry about this music. Where did my marble go? Marble scampered off. He scampered off. Uh oh. Look, now trouble's awake. Troubles are coming for us. He's laying on the cord. Here. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> Chaos. Chaos. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <clears throat> okay. Buddy, let's weigh you. Do you have to go potty? Uh, hi, Toto. Good morning. Marvel had a nice big poop last night. Are you done? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where's your mommy? <clears throat> oh, you're going to get in trouble. <laughs> All right, now, weighing the marble. So he's 264. So it's probably not. Probably didn't do too much nursing last night. I'm hoping a couple nights ago he did. He didn't drop overnight. So I'm hoping that if I leave him overnight, like I've been doing, he, one of these days he will figure out. What to do? Hi, little mama. Those are scampy babies. They're very scampy. Ready? And... Ready? And go. Where are you going? I know. Where are you going? There we go. Oh, there it is. Right there. So, uh, they will be three weeks old, if you can believe it, on Monday, I think. We'll have to check that, because they're 19 days old today, 20, 21, yep. 
Monday, three week birthday. Um, and early weaning can happen three and a half weeks to four weeks. I usually wait until their teeth start coming in before I offer them food. But I think in Professor Marvel's case, well, I'll see. I actually haven't checked his tooth status lately. Have I? So, could be as early as next weekend that I could try him on some gruel, which is a mix of the bottle formula and some smushy food. <coughs> Excuse me. Everybody's upside down in the nest right now. Whoops. What did, well, what's, going, what's going on? Let's see. Have you made any progress? Oh, a little bit. I know. Well, I know. Well, you're not really. There you go, bud. There you go. Oh, extreme close up. So for Marvel, at least, it would be good if he could start eating on his own. <clears throat> oh, mommy's being so cute right now. I really want to take a picture. But I can't because I don't have four hands. I do wish I had four hands. Oh, and someone has peed. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Do you smell a dirty bum? Right by, it's right by your face, Mama. It's right there. Now you're just messing around. There you go. Toto's bum could not be any closer to her face. And there's no indication that there's any interest in any sort of cleanup. <laughs> So Miss Dorothy's poop was getting a little bit better. It was a little bit better yesterday, but I see today it's uh, runny again, which is not unusual. Oh, Mr. Toto, are you going to come and visit me? Do you figure you have a better chance of getting your bum cleaned if you come see me? Such a smart boy. Toto has escaped the nest. He just comes and goes as he pleases now. He's a big boy. <laughs> 